sir. Hey, when you work here at SoCal Tank, you use high quality water. So, what's up, y'all? Happy Monday. Today is March 15, 2021. As you can see, it's a cold day at the shop. Here we have folks right watching this car in front of the shop. You know, busy day. Let me give you a little run around what's going on in the shop. Uh, as you can see, we're going to be busy today. It's going to be busy in a rainy day because you see it's slow. Here we have a 2021 RDS 6. We got PTF all over the car. And then it's also going to ceramic tent the whole windows. The ceramic is good, you want to block out the visibility just as the sun rays because it's going to get into the summer since it's going to be hot. We recommend getting a ceramic tin, but we also offer the regular film, such as the CS. Now we have a Honda Civic here getting tinted as well, but we're going to be using the regular film, the CS. You're going 5% all around, so it's good darken up the car, but you lose visibility, so always think of that when trying to get a tin. Hey, shit. That's good. All right, so sorry, y'all. Here we got the demon himself from Italy. Straight from Italy, got the Lamborghini Gallardo 2010. We're gonna have our wrap since Gabriel come over here and take care of the car. Right now, I'll give you all the details of what he's gonna do. Well, let me pass the mic to Gabriel here. What's up, guys? My name is Gabriel, the sensei, I guess, here at Soul Cal 10. Uh, here we have this uh, Gallardo that's getting wrapped in uh, satin by Avery, satin black. It has a uh, Ceramic coating on it to protect it against water spots, bird droppings, tree sap, uh, makes the surface harder, it makes it more durable against uh, scratches. Also makes it wrap keep looking newer for long, more longer. And uh, reduces orange peel that you do get in the wrap as well. Uh, it makes it look more like paint. And then here we're gonna make it uh, satin black. Just like the rest of the car. It's too bad we can't drive it though. <laughs> yeah, it's all good. This is all about getting the longevity of the vehicle. Make sure it looks good, stays looking good. Probably we have to deal with it over and over. So like I said, give us a few days and you'll see the Raptors and himself putting in work. So we'll keep y'all posted. So right now we're gonna go uh, pick up some film and wrap for the customers. Um, so he ordered or wrap for the Lamborghini, and I believe he's gonna go pick up a ceramic coating. So right now we're just following him uh, to Laverne. Yeah, the Tyson fight the night they shot pop. So I'm grown as fuck in this small phone. Nigga, don't just sit there roll some. I'm on some. It's so lovely. Stunning like she gave me your money. Pumping like a super soaker, honey. No bluffing in this fluffy in the Dougie Fresh. Beat. Day two of wrapping the uh, diffuser for this Gallardo. Almost done. Just need this piece left and uh, some pieces right here. And that's pretty much it. Almost done. A little bit harder than I expected. We got the Audi over there. quick rundown what goes down when you get a car ready for PPS and ceramic coating. So first off, I don't know if you guys heard me in the last clip, this is a 2021 Audi R6, so it's fresh out the lot. Usually you expect these cars to come out of perfect paint, but sadly there's still a little errors and little paint flaws that we have, so. Here we have the boss sensei going over with the buffing. Let me show you guys how what the outcome with the buffing side. At the tent shop, we offer three stages for buffing. We usually recommend the three stage even for the newer car that's the law. So this is how it looks after we just got done with the stages of the buffing. This paint looking flawless, sharper than ever. Like I said, this car is 2021 and our boss spent eight hours doing the buffing itself to ensure the paint's ready for the ceramic coating. But remember guys, patience is key when you're working on your car. You can't be rushing things like that just to make sure it comes out. I won't say half ad, but you know what I'm trying to say. So always take your time when you're working on your products, just like we do at our shop. We want to make sure the quality is five stars for you guys. That's all we focus on, five stars, all right?
What's up, y'all? Day three in the shop. It's a Wednesday afternoon. Usually we record in the morning, but today time beat us, but it's all good. So let me give you guys a little quick run on what's going on in the shop. So we had the Honda Accord 2018 pull up to get a tent and a roof wrap. So it's running limo tent. It looks nice, but I wouldn't suggest it because you lose visibility, so keep that in mind. All right now we're about to take off the shark tail of the car itself. That right? way we have more space for the foot pad. Being a shark, I was just a boneless fish. <laughs> this thing got a lot of wires and they expect it to be this That's long. what I'm saying. Yeah, so this I is the antenna of a Honda. So this is the spine. I'll get the picture so. So we just got a fish without even going to the water. It's like uh, one of those clown tricks on where it keeps pulling something. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, what magician? the fuck is that coming from? It's gonna be like one hour <laughs> later. <laughs> So I'll keep you guys updated with a few hours without the wrap done. And then we have this car that we need a tent. And then we showed you already the Audi R6, so keep y'all posted. So if you guys can see here, the shade that we put on the car on the windshield is 70%. So it's not making the windshield any darker, but it is going to help with uh, more heat rejection and then being a lot more comfortable in the car since this is where you sit most of the time. Uh, that is where you feel a lot of the heat. And especially when you don't tint the windshield, you know, all the other windows are tinted, but there's still heat coming in. So you're just pretty much trapping the heat. This is gonna make the car feel a lot cooler and uh, the driver as well, as well as protect the interior from like cracking and fading out and you know, stuff like that. So guys, we sent it from SoCal Tim Motorsports and today's the day we have to let go of the beach right here, the Audi R6. Sucks to see it go, but we're happy they're about to see it go fully protected. As you can tell, we did a full front package PPF on the vehicle itself. We got the hood, the front bumper, the fenders, and the side mirror caps covered with PPF. Not only did we do just the PPF, we also threw in the ceramic coating throughout the whole vehicle. I mean, finished it off with the final touches of XR Plus all over the windows, even the sun visor. So right now I'm gonna pass it to Gabriel for he can give you more in depth why you should run these type of products in your car. Hi, this is Gabriel from SoCal Tin. Uh, so the clear bra is gonna help with uh, keeping rock chips from damaging the paint of your car, especially being a really nice color like this one right here. Fixed paint like this, is actually gonna be pretty expensive, so it makes sense to do something like this uh, so you don't have to you spend the money on those type of repairs. Uh, and uh, the coating is gonna help keeping the car super shiny, super clean for uh, about four years. And then uh, it's gonna help against like water spots, tree sap, bird droppings, uh, reduces swirl marks, and uh, keeps the paint from oxidizing and fading out, so the color is gonna pop for years to come. The ceramic tint, is gonna help keeping the car a lot cooler and especially the interior from fading out, cracking, and then obviously keep the driver really comfortable when driving the car. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much the reason why you would wanna uh, go with products like this and keep your car looking nice for years to come.